Hey guys, this is Pastor. Have you seen this? A production of Allen Creek Community Church where we get a cold take of some sort of media that you have sent us. And then I respond with a Christian worldview or perspective. Any of our pastors, we will respond with a Christian worldview or pastorly perspective to your video. If you want to send us a video, you send it to social at ac3.org and you can send us anything. It could be Star Wars trivia. It could be hot takes, preferably hot takes on Christianity and the world. And what does the Bible have to say about those things? But please send me a Star Wars one just so I can comment on it because that would be awesome. Well, Without further ado, we're going to get started with this video right here. Or why would you believe that, that they aren't accurate? Well, for starters, okay, so you're familiar with the telephone game, right? Yeah. Okay. So are you aware, and if I'm wrong about this, I'd like to be corrected, but are you aware that the first writings about Jesus were, uh, you know, the first writings of the New Testament were 50 years after he had already died. So like they were using oral traditions to tell the story for 50 years. Are you aware of that? Yeah. So okay, so for 50 years, nothing was written down. Everyone was just repeating the story. And you've said you know the telephone game. Would you agree with me that if we play the telephone game, the story is likely to get changed? Or why would you believe that, that they aren't accurate? Well, for starters, okay, so you're familiar with the telephone game, right? Okay, so... Uh, so, first off, my, my first thing to say here is that when the... I'm, I'm looking at this video here, which no one knows that I'm looking at. Uh, for, for starters, uh, the first thing I want to talk about is that... Um, when the first account of the New Testament was written, there were actual eyewitnesses that were still alive during that account. So what you would have seen is uh, someone's writing the account of Jesus. Eyewitnesses could have corrected that account at any point. So to understand that, that these are eyewitness accounts. He's saying the telephone game, right? And as a youth pastor, I'm very aware of how that game goes because I'll say something like, I ate a peanut butter and jelly sandwich and it turns into I ate a jellyfish very quickly. But uh, if someone who knew that I said I ate a peanut butter and jelly sandwich went to the end of the game and what we always do at the end of the game is, hey, what did you hear? I heard that you ate a jellyfish. Well, the person at the front of the line would say, no, he said he ate a peanut butter and jelly sandwich. So there's a correction at the very end there. So his argument is flawed in the sense that there was eyewitness accounts around during that time. And he could even go further into the fact that um, multiple accounts were written down. Um, and each of those accounts were put next to each other and said, okay, these, these are exactly alike. These are exactly alike. These are exactly alike. And, and we took multiple and multiple accounts of the same story and put them all together and said, wow, they actually say the same thing. So um, I don't know what else to comment on that other than there were actual eyewitnesses that were still around during the time of the first account of the New Testament. And so I'm going to have to put that down in writing. And if you guys have another video to send us on this, that would be awesome. You can send it to social at ac3.org, and we would love to comment on it. Thank you so much.